What's up, everybody? Stephen Coletti here. We are uh, hanging out in my Winnebago, I like to call it. It's a very classic looking 70s trailer. And uh, we're here shooting Taylor Swift's video, White Horse, which I am very honored and happy to be on and excited to work on. We just got here a little bit ago, so we haven't shot yet, but uh, we're fired up. It's gonna be fun. A little disappointed that I'm gonna break some hearts, but uh, hopefully we'll wake up for it. And uh, come check it out. I'm not a princess. This ain't a fairy tale. I'm not the one you'll sweep off her feet. Lead her up the stairwell. This ain't Hollywood. This is a small town. I was a dreamer before you. This looks oh, like. So I'm sure it's attractive, though. Okay. My mom's carrying my umbrella for me. <laughs> it's a beautiful day in Nashville. Miserable. This should be like they should use this day for like the tourism commercials. Come to Nashville. Ah, 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 ah. It looks like fun. We've noticed a pattern for my music videos. Whenever we schedule a music video, the weather's going to be terrible in some way. For a love story, it was like record heat heat wave and then for picture to burn it was like freakishly cold for this one it's just way rainy but it's kind of good because we're going for that like gloomy dark look this video is really different from the videos I've done in the past because it's got a really sad element to it and also as far as the way it's shot it's not shot with all these vibrant colors popping at you usually the videos we do we try to have color you know, and for this one, we were really going for more muted tones. So when we all woke up and it was raining today, we were like, yes, awesome. You can't do a sad video that's supposed to be depressing with sunshine. Well, this is depressing. And we don't have sunshine, this so that's good. It's good. It's good when that happens. Oh, yes. The song White Horse is about a really sad breakup. It's about that moment where it all comes crashing down, when you realize that this person is not who you thought they were at all. I feel like he's everything I've ever wanted. So there's something you should know about him. I wrote this song um, about a year ago, and it's just crazy because my albums feel like they're these diaries, you know? I feel like I've put out a new diary for the world to read. And uh, this is a really personal song, and, you know, it's just... It's just interesting to go through that sort of thing and then and then be thinking about it a year later and then be making a video for it. Because, you know, obviously what happened in order for me to write this song was, you know, a guy strayed and I cried. Uh, but we didn't want it to be like another guy cheats on Taylor video because for Teardrops on My Guitar, I catch him cheating on me. For Picture to Burn, I catch him cheating on me. And it was inevitable that that sort of behavior was gonna go on in this video, but we twisted it. You know, this girl falls in love with this guy and he's perfect and he's adorable and he's charming and he's endearing and she falls in love with him and then she comes to realize that he's been le leading a double life and that he was already in a relationship for years before he ever met her. And so it's not really another guy cheats on me video, it's really, you know, you find out that I'm the one that's kind of ruining a relationship without even knowing it. Good, still rolling? Taylor, look past Tia out the window at the rain. Trey's amazing. I've done all my videos with Trey, and she just completely understands where we want to go and, and what we should do to be different from all the other videos we've done in the past. It's so natural having her do my videos because I've never had anyone else do them. And she's so amazing at it. She's got such an eye for the way things should look and the way things should be shot and she you know she used to be an actress so she's really great at coaching you on what you should be doing in a certain situation and look back at Tia and down and find the rain again one more time for me deep breath okay good okay, with yeah. Trey we just completely understand each other. She's such a strong woman, and it's just so cool to work with her. We're reading this thing called the birthday book. The birthday book! 
I love the birthday book. This is Steven, and he's gonna be in my video. Steven's awesome at card tricks. Pick a card, cut the deck, and then he's gonna supposedly find it. We're reading this thing called The Birthday Book and my makeup artist got it for me for my birthday. And it has literally every date in the entire year in it and you can go to yours and read what it says. Like, it gives you a personality profile. The Birthday Book! I love The Birthday Book! It has every date of the year in there and you go to your birthday and it tells you what kind of person you are. They may or may not be big physically, but even those of a small frame convey a weighty presence. Uh, such a presence may be intimidating to some, reassuring to others, but in any case, Sagittarius 3 is hard to ignore. And it's accurate. It's completely accurate. Often they are better, better to express themselves through writing than speech. Hmm. They must learn to control their tempers. It said something like, um, if, you, if you hurt me or if you get on my bad side, I have, I go into a rage and my wrath can be quite frightening. I don't know about that. When they fly into a rage, their wrath can indeed be frightening. I think for, I think this is a good book, though. I think that goes along with the fact that, like, you know, if you do something really bad, I'm gonna write a song about you. Maybe that maybe that's the wrath that they're talking about. I'm not violent. This is Steven, and he's gonna be in my video, and I'm so Everybody. excited. Very excited to be here. It's gonna be really fun. Steven was my first choice for this video because um, I thought he was great on One Tree Hill. And I had watched Laguna Beach like when he, when it was on, and I was always like, oh, he is so cute. Um, and then I saw him on One Tree Hill, and I was like, oh, he can act. That's cool. Um, and I think the reason why he's perfect for this role in this video is because we were looking for someone who comes off very sweet and endearing. I've had a hand in picking most of my video guys um, because it's a, it's a really important thing. Like they each have to stand for something different and represent different things. You know, it's so much more than just like picking like a model off of a picture and be like, oh well, he's hot. You know, it's like for a picture to burn, we wanted him to be just like, just classically like almost too cute. So we chose Justin Sandy, who's like almost too cute. Oh, for Teardrops on My Guitar, it was Drew, who looks like, you know, the cute guy who wouldn't know that you like him. And for Love Story, it was Justin Gaston, the Prince Charming, could have been alive in, like, the 1800s and still would have been looking the same. You know, he looked very timeless, and that's kind of what we looked for there. And for Steven, the reason why I thought he would be perfect for this video is because he just looks so sweet. And the guy that we wanted for this video is someone who just looks so sweet that you would never expect that they would ever lie. And he's got this little, you know, I'm not gonna hurt you, I'm nice kind of thing going on. And so we wanted to make a guy seem very endearing before he breaks my heart so that, you know, nobody else saw it coming either. You know, that's always the hardest thing when someone completely has you fooled so much that you think they're just never gonna hurt you, and then they do. That's that's when you get the worst heartbreak. Hey, you're not too nice in this I'm sorry. video. I'm sorry. So what was, what was going on, on my birthday again? February 7th, upside down. Try it again. Weaknesses. We, no, we don't need to talk about weaknesses. <laughs> no weaknesses. There's actually nothing there. It's There's blank. There's nothing under weaknesses. It's completely blank. The no. book ends there. Unrealistic, over permissive, and dissatisfied. Yeah. When's your There's birthday? much more. Go to Barnes and Noble and pick up yourself a copy. It's a birthday book. I swear it's valid. It was my favorite birthday present that I got this year. Endorsed here by Taylor Swift and Stephen Colletti. We promise you. Yeah. Stephen's awesome at card tricks. Or like one card trick. Hopefully that's good. Pick a card and then cut the deck and then he's gonna supposedly find it. I gotta find it. Okay. I didn't look at it. Was I supposed to look at it? No. I was, I was just... Okay. Um, well, I don't know what card I picked. That was part of the deal. <laughs> oh, my God. I just forgot to look. I forgot that that, that was a step of it. Okay. Because I was so focused on cutting the deck accurately. It's a simple rookie's mistake. <laughs> Got it. We're sitting there, and we're, you know, we're kind of, like, lounging on the couch with 30 people around. People never really know how many people it takes to put on a production. Are you sure to ask? They're all staring. It's not that weird. We're playing cards. Yeah. And it's, right. it, it's there's people taking pictures, which is a little awkward, but 
you just keep talking and you keep playing cards, and it's no big deal. Because unless you make it a big deal, it's not. Honestly, like with video people, um, you know, mostly video guys that I have that I have to flirt with on camera. I don't, I don't know. It's, it's usually pretty awkward. It's just that you don't know them um, and you're blah, blah, blah. But Steven's very bantery. So, you know, when you can have a conversation with someone, it's just really fun to work with them and it doesn't feel like it's awkward. I looked at the card. Oh, you did? Yeah. Where'd you put it? Oh, you have it. I have it here. <laughs> Am I supposed to put it on the bottom? Uh, you can put it on the bottom. And then you can cut it. Don't let me see the bottom, so cut it that way. Take that much. Okay. The card's still in there? Mm-hmm. All right. I don't like any of those. Okay. Oh my god, how did you do that? Is that it? That's amazing. <laughs> That's like the best party trick ever. Basically, I guessed, he guessed the card that I picked and it was really weird. Like my poncho? I was completely blown away. I love your poncho. That's great. That's, that's waterproof. This is my music video best friend, Tia. Basically, what she goes on to tell me is that he's in another relationship. <laughs> I go and I confront him. He lives with another girl. Maybe we'll have, like, a push in there. Now it's too late for you and your white horse to come around. The video starts out with a phone call. The guy's like making excuses. He's like, -huh -huh. you know, he's like, I don't have a girlfriend. What? What? And he's like, Will you give me another chance? Do you love me? Will you give me another chance? Basically, the first half of the video is just these wonderful, lovely, adorable moments of when we were together and things were perfect. And you see me go out to lunch with my, one of my friends, Tia. This is my music video best friend, Tia, and we're having a blast. <laughs> With, uh, with our lines and with improvising them, <laughs> with completely making them up. I'm like, she gets up and gives me the high, like, I'm on the floor, like, convulsing. <laughs> 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 uh, 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 <laughs> and one, you want to be like, I saw your man cheating on you. I saw him out by the corpse. They were picking apples. <laughs> We've done these lines in different dialects, different languages, different storylines even. Where is that white horse? Actually, the white horse is about to make an entrance. It's going to trot through the restaurant and turn the table over. There's a white horse? What is that horse doing in here? Where is it? And oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> and then you realize what the song is about. Am I missing something? A horse that ruined dinner because it just like decided to come into the restaurant and run around. Yeah. I have not seen the white horse. Out of nowhere, a rainbow appears and he trots up it and becomes a unicorn. Am I the white horse? Did you say unicorn? Yes. Those are so awesome. I know. Seriously. Does it have one of these? What if there was a unicorn Pegasus combo? Oh man. Seriously. They can think fly about off that. and everything. Think about that. So you like Hold on. Take a second. A Pegacorn. A Pegacorn. Oh my god. I'm sure that like <laughs> with enough practice in a laboratory we could do that. She's a cool chick. Basically what she goes on to tell me is that he's in another relationship and that he has been for a long time. He's been lying to me. You know, and I go and I confront him. Maybe we'll have like a push in there, just so, just to have that on film. But um, while he's trying to explain himself, I look up and in the doorway I see another girl. So he's, he lives with another girl. And so I see her, she sees me, he sees her, he sees me, we all see each other. It's just like, ah, what's going on? Oh my God. And so I freak out and turn around and run. And I'm bawling my eyes out running down the street as I am bawling my eyes out for the rest of the video. Spoiler alert. Crying on camera is, is sort of a art form in itself. I mean, honestly, you have to be in a place in your head where you can do something that you usually do all by yourself, alone in your bedroom, with no one watching. You have to do that in front of 30 people. And so Trey came up and talked to me beforehand, and she was like, what makes you the saddest? Who makes you the saddest? And I told her, and she was like, just think about that. Stay with that one thing. Just think about that, and it'll make you cry. 
Taylor's actually, she's an exceptional actress, and I, I'm, I'm putting out there and predicting that she's gonna go on to do a lot of other cool things in the acting world. Um, she's just a natural. She's got great instincts, she's smart, she takes direction really well, so she's gonna make a very fine actress. I would love to do more acting in the future. I think that would be wonderful. I mean, anything, like my favorite shows, any kind of uh, supporting character on my favorite shows would be awesome. <laughs> Why, God, why? Okay, Scarlett, cut. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> but Jim, he has no right, brain. We're out of his house. Okay, guys, the gate's clean. We're out of his house. Thank you very much. Stay tuned for Taylor Swift's new video, Hey, Steven. <laughs> All right, all serious. <laughs> Kidding aside. Stay tuned for Taylor Swift's new video, White Horse. We just wrapped the shoot and it's done. The video is done and I'm so excited for you to see it. This is the new video for White Horse.